Hey guys, back. <laughs> no Macala butt. Um, we'll give you a quick demonstration on the tilt sensor. Um, we did do it in the previous video, but um, I thought like let's make another one where we can properly show you how it works and what to do. Um, pretty sure I got internet already. Nope. Give me a second. So we'll go through and how to set it up and we'll go through the performance of it. So if you give me a second, I will set it up all right All right. Um, ah, screen recording. Okay. All right. For the sake of it, we'll start a new project. Make that from test one and neither one go. Connect it just as normal. And then I think it's already. Oh yeah, it's already connecting to the to the network, which is good. And just. Sure, that is good. Yeah, that is good. All right, so it's got a fix now. Um, we've got an empty project. You can add a code to it. Here we go, see that one or that one. So all we have to do now is activate the, the tilt sensor, which is uh, you go to settings, you go to IMU, you click use tilt it's telling you to rock it back and forth twice and that's it and now it's activated so um, what we can do is you can measure a point stored in there we can go to the exact point that we want to stake out and we just measure it which is this one, which is obviously we're already on there. And as you can see, it's staying within the values. And you can walk around it. And as you can see, it's staying in there. Not anymore because I think I. No, oh, well that's great. Connection dropped. Give me a second. Uh, some reason my internet dropped. But let's just go to cat. Points, points manager, this one, add. There you go. Now we're back in there. So you can see you can hold it as 
They say 60 degrees. I'm not sure where 60 is. Probably there. As you can see, it's holding pretty well. So yeah, that's the field sensor. As you can see, you move it, it's gone. Move it back to the point, which I think it was that one. And that's it. Simple as that. All right, good.